Hello and welcome to NTU Library's video guide to the Taylor & Francis Online Database. Taylor & Francis Online are an online database with thousands of journals covering subjects like humanities, social sciences, science and technology, engineering, medicine and healthcare. In addition to their journal holdings, Taylor & Francis Online also offer access to one of the world's largest collections of ebooks in the fields of science, technology, engineering, medicine, humanities and social science. Their publications contain high-quality, peer-reviewed articles and research that are ideal information sources for your assignments, annotated bibliographies, and literature reviews. Due to the wide range of subjects they cover, chances are good that if you're an MTU student, Taylor & Francis Online will have material relevant to your assignments. So, let's jump into the functionality. Taylor & Francis Online's homepage has a few ways to find information. First of all, there's the search box, which is located at the center of the page. Here you can perform targeted or general searches using keywords, author names, article titles, DOIs, etc. Simply type your, in your search terms and click the magnifying icon. You can also choose to perform an advanced search. Here you can specify the category of keywords and include Boolean operators. Include a publication date range to your search or search using a citation. The central text of this page includes a helpful guide to using Boolean operators and, or, and not. If we go back to the database homepage, you will also have the option to scroll a little further down and search by general subject heading. If you're looking for more general information, let's perform a search using the search box. Now we're at the results page. We can see that there are more than 135,000 results. This number is so high because I've used a fairly general search term. Underneath the number of search results, we can see there are options to save or export the search results in case you want to be able to return to the search later or send it on to a collaborator. On the left-hand side of the page are your list of filters. These allow you to narrow down your search by selecting various criteria like subject, journal, publication date, and language. The first filter option is access type. Go ahead and check only show content I have full access to. This means that any content you don't have access to won't appear in the results. Further down, we've got the option to modify the search by adding or removing terms or keywords to the search. In the middle of the screen, we have the first 10 of our thousands of search results. Each result presents us with the article title, author names, journal details, and publication date. Clicking on the title leads you to the article's web page. At the top of the page, we can see the details of the journal in which the article is published, including volume, issue, and publication date. Underneath, we can see the article title, authors, publication details, and DOI. Additionally, Taylor & Francis Online provide accessibility options above the title, such as listening to the page text read aloud, altering the text size, or downloading an MP3 of the text, among others. Scrolling down a little, we can see a menu on the left-hand side of the article. This is similar to a table of contents and allows you to see the content and structure of the article, as well as jump to the relevant section for you. Above the article is a banner with several functions, including the options to view or download the article in either PDF or EPUB format. Additionally, the banner provides options to view the article's figures and data, references, citations, and metrics. On the right-hand side of the article, Taylor & Francis Online provide their own recommended articles and related research on topics similar to the article you've chosen. In the center of the page is the full text of the article, which you can read from the web page if you prefer not to download the EPUB or PDF versions. When you're finished reading through the article, you can click back to return to the search, or if you want to perform a new search, simply click top, and then click on the Taylor & Francis online logo 
at the top of the page, which will bring you back to the database homepage. Thanks for watching, and please don't hesitate to contact a library staff member if you have any additional questions or queries.